Alright guys, today I'm going to be doing a guide on blood builds, and yeah, let me just get started. Here's the kind of gear you want to bring, um, either prayer or some strength gear like this, and then you're going to have guffins and but like to, to, to heal you, and then you're going to have Pete Owens peaches if you're doing this method at my low level, and just some miscellaneous food. Um, I bring these just for main healing food, because they're like two pieces of 11 heal, well 110 healing. Then this, like if I switch to Guthans and I'm trying to get my HP up with that, without using this. And then Guthans fails me, I'll just eat one of these two things to heal in like a big bulk. So yeah, just follow my route to get there. It's in the Slayer Tower in Canifus. So if you, you should already know what that's at, but if you don't, you know, just whatever. So just follow my route. So as you see, once you get in the Slayer Tower, you're going to want to run to the stairs over here. If you have 61 agility, you can, oh my god, alright. If you have 61 agility, you can, um, there's a little, like, chain that hangs down around this area. Right there, and then you can just climb up that. But if you're going to go up there, either have the Slayer Helmet or a, uh, nose peg in your bank, and you're not in your bank, but your inventory. Because, uh, that's right where Everett Spectres are. So, yeah, I don't have 61 agility, I only have 41, so I will not be using that. Um, I, I now have 73 defense, cool. 59 slayer, 24 summoning. Yeah, just it's pretty cool. I think I got 93 combat now. Trying to work on at least 40 uh, summoning for a bull ant because that's just the beast of burden and I'd need something like that. Uh, after that, I kind of want to go straight to 68 or whatever with, for the bunny up, whatever that is, because a bunny up would be nice to have too. So yeah, I just walk through the very first part, and then once you get there, you just want to, I just go up the stairs, I rest right here, and then that, not the Ember Spectre, but the uh, Blood Velds are over here, and I'm just going to show you a little technique that I use once I get there, so yeah, once you have about 50 runs, you should be good. Now you just got to, Mosquito, sorry, fucking piece of shit, Mosquito. Sorry for the language there, I just can't stand mosquitoes. You just go this way, just keep coming over here. And yeah, I'm sorry if my voice is annoying. I know I, I sound kind of weird on the mic. I don't sound like that in real life, trust me. Like, I just don't. But yeah. Alright, and just attack the blood builds. Now, they like rally me usually, so I'm not sure. I usually bring an SS, but I brought my Defender and Whip this time. Plus, I didn't bring D legs, I brought Chain Scare, just save inventory space. But yeah. Main idea is you're gonna want to, uh, just once you get your HP, you got down, down, I think below. I usually go to like 400. I switch out to Guthans like that, you know. I can't yet, but. Here. So you just after you get that you kill a few blood velds. I pick up the char. Tr I'll pick up the charm after I get. I got show you guys the Gotham switch. So you know just keep doing that. Then if your HP just below 400, just put on the Gothams. Swipe until you get above about 600 or 650. Put your gear back on. Once you use about eight of these, just start using bones to peaches tabs so you can stock up on food and just use the peaches. Other than that, guys, that's about it. Uh, that's just a little guide that I use for Blood Bell, just letting you guys know how I do it and stuff. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see ya.